All right, okay, good morning, everybody. Hang on. Hey, look, Facebook told me that I'm live. Isn't that cool? How y'all doing this morning? My name is Tom Rigsby. This is 7 Minutes in the Morning, but I'm guessing you probably knew that already. Thank you so much for joining me today and all week this week. Um, we'll see if I can get through this one. The, uh, the old voice <clears throat> is giving me challenges this morning. Apparently there's a whole new set of uh, allergens here <laughs> that, uh, that I'm not quite used to yet. So I had a little bit of that going on yesterday, but it's nothing that a good warm cup of coffee won't solve. Hey, listen, I would appreciate it tremendously if you would do me a favor when you get here. Doesn't matter if you're watching live or on the replay, just drop me a comment there and let me know that you are here. Uh, it's always happy for me to see people that are here and know who you are. And, because I can see that there are people there, just can't watch and see who you are. Let's open that all the way. All right. Um, yeah, and the other thing I would appreciate is if uh, you enjoy our conversations every morning, if you would share this uh, with your network to... Um, Help spread the word a little bit. All right, so this morning, I kind of titled this morning's show, The Best Way of Learning, which uh, <clears throat> when Eric has a chance to watch and comment, he, I'm sure he will have a comment about this. Um, this actually comes from a quote, a Richard Branson quote, nonetheless, and it said, look, I even have something special for you. <sighs> look, I can put it on the screen. Uh... Okay, uh, the best way of learning about anything is by doing. The best way of learning anything is by doing. Now, what does that mean? We spend a tremendous amount of time trying to gather knowledge, collecting knowledge, if you will, so that we can have all the answers to all the questions before we start anything. And if we don't, we need to take another class or buy another product or read another book. We have to have all the answers. We have to learn everything there is to know before we get started. The reality is that's probably not the best way to do it. You, you need a framework. That's why, you, you know, when I put together programs uh, and share them with you, I tend to make them frameworks, right? Because... Here's a framework that you can use to fill in your own set of circumstances, the own, your own learning, your own experience, and then point you in a, in a particular direction. You know, nobody is going to have all the answers because you are unique. We are each uniquely gifted, talented, and placed. That means that no matter what my learning, what my experience is, um, it, it's going to be different. For you, right? So just get started. Just get started. Will you make mistakes? Yes. Will things not work correctly for you? Yes. And you know what? That's okay. <laughs> That's the way it's supposed to be. How do you learn? How do you learn to walk? Right? We learn to walk by falling down. We learn, we also learn how to get up from that, hopefully. Um, we, everything we learn, we learn by making mistakes. It's trial and error is the way that our brain is wired to learn. So don't be afraid to get started. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. Just start. And you will find that this big, ugly, scary thing that's been out there is not so bad after all. So here's my question for you and my admonition for you today. What? Are you collecting information about that you can start working on today? Just get started. One thing, that's all it has to be. Take one step. And then I, I, I can, well, there's my office assistant just woke up. <laughs> um, come here, writer. Come here. I guarantee that if you'll take that first step, that the second one won't seem nearly as scary. Hey, come up here. Say good morning to everybody. Come here. Come on. There we go. Can you see, there she is. She was sleeping quietly back there. I guess I got a little too wrapped up and woke her up. All right, that's it for this morning, everybody. 
Um, I'm not sure yet what tomorrow's show holds. We're supposed to be driving on the road tomorrow. I might, if, uh, if I'm not driving, I'll go ahead and do the show. Um, but we'll have something up for you tomorrow. All right. You guys have a great, th- remember it's thankful Thursday also. Be sure and drop a comment down there. Let me know something that you're thankful for. It's always a great way to start the day, uh, with a sense of gratitude. All right. All right, that's it. You guys have a great Thursday. I'll be back. Talk to you again tomorrow. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Take care.